Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from Salads and Sandwiches of 1917, we're going to be making the Hunter's Sandwich, parentheses, Switzerland. Now, this is not to be confused with the Shooter Sandwich, which has gone around social media, which is, you know, the one with the big loaf of bread and two steaks in it. This is decidedly different. So a lot of you were wondering uh, about this bread slicer that I talked about the other day. It's basically from 1955. It's called a slice of slice and you put a piece of bread in it, like that, and it holds it, and you uh, do your bread knife. And voila! Now we butter those thin slices of bread. Now we top that with brie, of course. Now we add a layer of honey. Okay, let's give this hunter's sandwich a go. It's not bad. Honey goes really well with brie. Um, sweetness goes well with brie, like an apricot jam, and you bake it in the oven, it's really good. Um, I don't know that this would sustain me if I was out hunting, but hey, what do I know? Except that I want to plus it up. And add some slivered almonds. And what the heck, a little black pepper. Okay, let's give this hunter's sandwich plussed up with uh, slivered almonds and black pepper. Go. Not gonna lie, this is tasty. So the nuttiness of the almonds is playing off the richness of the brie and working really well with its flavor. It's also working really well with the honey and the black pepper just bringing this sort of nice little bite to it. All right, so the original hunter's sandwich, it was tasty actually. Brie and honey go together pretty well. Uh, the butter was there to keep the bread from sogging out since it was thin. So I kind of get that as far as the honey is concerned, maybe not on the brie side, but it was a pretty rich sandwich. It was something that would be nice to snack on, but I don't know that I would want to be served lunch this, and I don't know if it would sustain me out in the field uh, hunting. But I'm going to go ahead and give that, I'm going to give that a seven. I just like that combination of brie and honey. That actually works really well. Plus up with the slivered almonds and the black pepper. To me, that's like an eight. That is delicious. I'm absolutely going to finish that. I would make this again, uh, especially the plussed up version, but I don't think I would make it as lunch. I would serve it as like a tea sandwich or a snack or something like that. All right, I'm going to finish that. See you tomorrow. Oh, really? I'm going to finish that.